A sea fan is carefully brought out of the water and checked that it is not damaged before being resubmerged in an appropriate location for further development by marine biologists from the Phuket Marine Biological Center or PMBC. The richness of the seawater off Chelong Bay on the south side of Phuket Island has led to the implementation of several high-value aqua cultivation farms by local fishermen. This factor also led to the re-emergence of sea fans in the area. Under a floating fish farm belonging to Kun Chakrun Kun Sapyu lie sea fans of the Melithiae family. In an effort to preserve this rare marine life form, the owner has worked with PMBC marine biologists to remove over 50 sea fans to replant in the deep sea. This is carried out under, under the Return Sea Fans Back to the Sea program, a joint operation carried out by PMBC staff and the Greenfin Project. The sea fan found here is of Meritia family, which grow in shallow water approximately 5 to 10 meters in depth. The fertility of the farming cages here is one factor of its development. The sea fan usually takes microorganisms such as plankton as food. The amount of sea fan found around here is probably due to the abundant amount of food as it's a fish farm. The abundance of food and the water conditions at Chalong Bay are also beneficial to the cultivation of high-value seafood. That leads to good farming of lobsters and fishes. The seafood from these farms feed local restaurants. Kunta Run Konsapyu, a local fisherman, told us. It's an egg-laying location. As you can see, when we lift up the sea fan, there are plenty of baby fishes and shrimps attached to the branches. This enables easier breeding for us, as after the eggs are laid, they will reside in the sea fan branch, which is an ideal shelter to hide away from big fish. The sea fan is reportedly a genius of invertebrate marine animals. It is a variety of coral composed of numerous polyps, cylindrical sessile forms, that grow together in a flat fan-like pattern. Each polyp in the colony has some multiple of six tentacles as opposed to the eightfold symmetry. The central internal skeleton, composed of a flexible substance called gorgonian, supports all branches of the colony and living tissues form a layer over its entire surface. The tissues are often colored in hues of red, yellow or orange. As the Phuket Marine Biological Center works to replant sea fans, it also carries out research to study its life cycle and find a means of preservation. The efforts follow a decline in sea fan populations in both the Gulf of Thailand and the Andaman Sea, as locals like to keep them as decorative items and amulets. In reality, by leaving the sea fan in the sea, they can help conserve natural marine resources and help maintain the balance of the undersea ecological system.